वन वे अनोवा द वन वे एनालिसिस ऑफ वेरियंस इज यूज टू डिटर्मिन वेदर देयर आर एनी स्टेटिस्टिकली सिग्निफिकेंट डिफरेंसेस बिटवीन द मीन्स ऑफ टू और मोर इंडिपेंडेंट ग्रुप्स विच आर अनरिलेटेड ऑल दो यू टेन टू ओनली सी इट यूज वेन देयर आर अ मिनिमम ऑफ थ्री रादर दैन टू ग्रुप्स सिंपली वन वे अनोवा इज एन एक्सटेंशन ऑफ इंडिपेंडेंट टी टेस्ट हेयर इज एन एग्जाम्पल इन विच वी कैन अप्लाई वन वे अनोवा अ मैनेजर वॉन्ट टू बूस्ट प्रोडक्टिविटी ऑफ हिज कंपनी बाई एक्सलरेटिंग द रेट एट विच हिज स्टाफ कैन यूज अ स्पेसिफिक स्पीड शीट अ बेसिक मीडियम एंड हायर कोर्सेज आर अवेलेबल बाई अ थर्ड पार्टी मैनेजर टेन टेन एम्प्लॉयज टू बेसिक कोर्स टेन टू मीडियम एंड टेन टू हायर सिंस ही इज नॉट श्योर विच कोर्स इज रिक्वायर्ड फॉर द टाइप ऑफ वर्क दे डू एट हिज कंपनी आफ्टर फिनिश द ट्रेनिंग दे असाइन द एम्प्लॉयज a problem to solve using the spreadsheet program he then analyzes the average time it took to complete the task for each of the three classes basic medium and higher to determine if there are any discrepancies you can now we can enter the data in spss here we have two variable first variable is the course and this is numeric type and here is the column width you can increase the width of the column according to variable length you can uh, here we have labeled the first variable basic medium higher because employees got training on basic course medium course and higher course so here we will assign the value 1 to basic add 2 to medium and 3 to higher course add and press the button okay this is the nominal and second variable is the time this is numeric this is the width and we will label it average time took to complete the problem so here we select the scale this is scale now go to data view this is the time taken by the employees who took the basic course this is the time who took the medium course and this is the time who took the higher course now you can change this with the help of this one if when you press a it will give you the basic medium it will give you the string when you press the one it will give you the number so uh, you can change it according to if you want string or numeric now go to analysis and uh, in analysis compare mean when we are nova and this is the average time taken by the employees to solve the problem and this goes to the dependent list with the help of arrow and this is the factor variable and now you will press the button option in option you select the descriptive and you press the post hoc and uh, remember the post hoc tucky you will select the tucky the tucky post hoc test is generally the preferred test for conducting post hoc test on a one way anova but there are many others now press the button continue and press the button okay and get the output in in output first you will pay attention to this descriptive then 
the then the this table ANOVA and here this table shows this descriptive shows the employees who took the basic course average time took to complete the problem problem is 27.20 and the employees who took the medium course uh, time to complete the problem is 23.20 and employees having the higher course took 20.20 time to complete the problem and this is the f value which is significant because p value is less than 0 0.05 and now we go to the multiple comparison this multiple comparison table we can see from this table that there is a statistically significant difference in time to complete the problem between the group that took the basic course and medium course this is basic this is medium this difference is significant because p value is less than 0 0.05 which is 0 0.029 and as well as between the higher course and basic course higher and basic this is also this shows the significant difference between these two however there were no significant difference between the group that took the medium and higher course this is medium this is higher and there are no significant difference so this is all about the output now we can see the tables how we can can report the result descriptive this is the APS trial one way ANOVA one way ANOVA as you see the F values this is the between between group this is the within group this is the sum of square and this is the mean square degree of freedom degree of freedom here too because uh, uh, you have the three variables so k is equal to 3 and k minus 1 so degree of freedom is 2 and uh, total students are 30 10 to basic course uh, total employees are 30 10 to basic course 10 to medium course and 10 to higher course so 30 minus 3 is 27 p value is f value is 4.95 which is significant and uh, here is the reporting there was a statistically significant difference between groups as determined by one way ANOVA so it uh, indicates there is a significant difference between the three groups uh, employee took time uh, different times and there was a significant difference um, by the employees to solve the problem there is a, po a Turkey post hoc test revealed that there is a statistically significant difference in time to complete the problem between the group that took basic course and medium course as well as between the basic course and higher course however there are no difference between the group that took medium and higher course so uh, F test is very helpful in understanding the difference between the three groups